the Honourable Shabambu. Board Honourable Members. Thank you, thank you very much, uh, Chairperson. The Economic Freedom Fighters supports the appointment of Advocate Busisi Wemkwebana as the Public Protector of South Africa. We believe that she did decidedly better than all the candidates that came for the interviews in the process of selecting a public protector for the next seven years in South Africa. We were particularly impressed by her understanding of the independence of the public protector's office, that it is only accountable to the Constitution, and of course administratively accountable to Parliament. We are also impressed by her experience and familiarity with the office of the public protector, having worked there before for more than five years, established offices during her tenure as an employee in the office of the public protector. We think that quality is going to make her capable to hit the ground running when she takes over office. But also we're impressed by her commitment and determination to make the office of the public protector accessible Meaning that the people of Mshabuya Lingana, the people of Malamlele, the people of Josini, the people of Emadangain, the people of Hekeng are going to have access to the office of the public protector because she has got the most believable and practical plan on how the people can gain access to the office of the public protector. But also she said herself that she is not politically affiliated and does not have any relations with any politicians. If that information is covered to be not true, the EFF will go for judicial review because we have appointed her on wrong information. So we believe what she said, that she is not politically affiliated and that she does not have any relations with any politician. So we believe the presentation that she gave us. We are going to ask a few things from her. Number one is that public protector Mkwebani must serve with integrity and consistency. Number two is that you must not be captured by politicians. Never sell your soul to politicians, particularly the incumbent government, because soon they are not going to be in government. In 2019, majority of these people whom you think are senior in government are not going to be government of South Africa, they're going to be opposition, so it will not help you with anything. But also you must be humble. You must have the temperament that you demonstrated during the interview process. You must not be easy to be angered by anyone because there will be lots of criticisms that are going to come your way as a public protector. Those are the things, the things that we are asking from you but also want to use this opportunity to pay tribute to advocate Tulima Donsela for a job well done. She has done very well as a public protector. She indeed became the biblical David who fought the most powerful and the well-resourced Goliath and she, she emerged victorious. We have since written to the speaker of the National Assembly that in terms of Rule 62, we should invite Advocate Tulima Donsela to come and address this house because we can take a resolution to do so. So she must be allowed to bid farewell and give certain advices to public administrators, to politicians, on how do we avoid order, circumstances order. where we are going to misuse public resources, uh, we are going to avoid the undue benefits, we are going to avoid undue delays in the provision of services. I think we must give that opportunity to the outgoing public protector. But we support the advocate Busisi Mkwebana as the incoming public protector. We have got faith in here. We are going to work with her where we disagree, we disagree. Your Thank time you has much. now expired. Thank you.